Larry Ward coming to you today from High Performance Golf Academy located at Keen Trace Golf Club. I'm going to talk to you about impact a little bit today and a little bit about numbers, but those numbers and your ball flight won't make any difference to you at all if you don't know where you hit the face. I suggest you go get some, uh, uh, this is basically odor control powder spray that I got at Walgreens. Um, so if you notice this golfer had an impact point pretty high on the face, pretty close to the center, and we created an, a, a launch angle of 11 degrees with 1800 spin with a smash factor of 149. And we've got a curve that we've created there as well, okay? Very important to understand with technology or without, where you hit the ball on the face is king. You hit it a little bit on the toe, it's going to change the gear effect and the spin. A little on the heel, it's going to change it dramatically sometimes. Higher on the face relative to low. Lower on the face, the ball's going to go lower to the, to the surface, lower to the ground with more spin. Higher on the face, usually a little higher with less spin. Your golf club, the brand that you choose, there's going to be a little different spot that's going to maximize your uh, performance. Sometimes knowing that spot's very, very important. It's not always dead in the center of the club. But just by seeing that spot over and over when you practice, you're going to really get some great feedback. Because the, the golf clubs now, they're a little different. You, you don't really get feedback in your hands. You can't really tell. I suggest you hit most of your practice shots with a spray on the face. If we can help you any further, go to hpgolfacademy.com. A high-performance golf academy video.